Good morning. Welcome to another exciting episode of DDO Wiki Talk with your host Technical13, aka Shoemaker. Let's take down the splash screen here. How was everybody this morning? Let me load up the um, giveaway program this morning. a couple things that I came to mind to run this week to um, to do let's get this started bring this down drag this over here I'm gonna do 500 DDO points um, I'd like to see this on screen here I'd like to see 10 viewers this morning if you're in chat say good morning and we'll save this as episode 64 that down bring this back up all right let's check out what's on the recent changes page what have we missed in the last week <clears throat> UL did some work creating some cosmetic pages which we should probably talk about. The page naming convention isn't quite optimal. Have to start a discussion and maybe move those around. Looks like um, Untitled started a 2017 Players Council page. Some redirects created from Reincarnation Cache to the appropriate section on the bank page. Some discussion about which pages populate as free to play, which is actually on my list of things to talk about today. That's about it. Now, let's see here. All right, so we just have a base page there. There's nobody listed on it yet. Good morning, Migo. Let's add you to the giveaway. You are attendee number one. I know of at least one member that's carried over as they've said as much on their stream the other night. It's like there's a few members here. We'll 
go with that. Those are the ones that I know of. I have recovered from my stream. Add you to the giveaway this morning. Uh, you are R O B O R O S two two three. Save. All right, so there's some discussion on the raids talk page. Um, not free to play, riding out the storm as part of the Dragon Blood Prophecy expansion. It is not free to play. So I fixed it. It's fixed by adding the ad pack temp um, parameter to the um, quest template on the page itself. I know, convoluted. Good morning, Rick. And Thar. So I fixed it. It was then mentioned that Vod Hawks, legendary Hawks, are part of Veil of Twilight, not free to play. Fire and Thunder Peak is part of Thunderhome. Lord of Blades is part of Secrets of the Artificer. And all of those were fixed. Crew pointed out that Ellie Hawks. Is not it is free to play even if the heroic is not and that's what I thought too but I need some kind of confirmation from a free to, free to play person to make sure that that's correct so if you're free to play and you've played legendary Hawks and why RBJJN moderator let me know and we can fix that right up also fix it so that instead of going to Lord of Blades it goes to the Lord of Blades instead of the character So, is Legendary Hound of Zoria part of the Veil of Twilight pack or not? Pretty sure it isn't, so I'm going to remove it. Good morning, Gummy Bears. Then we can have a discussion if somebody thinks it is. Copy this, put it up here.
add gummy bears to the giveaway this morning. <clears throat> if you're not already following the GDO Wiki Twitter, I strongly recommend doing so. Alrighty, so... So that's done. All right, legendary hot is all right. You can see it's no longer marked as an ad pack. Um, it should be happening in about an hour and a half. Excellent. All right, so we got some wanted categories that we need to go through. It's been a while. Some of these need to be populated, created. Some of them need to be fixed. For example, INS Constitution plus eight is incorrect. We need to fix that. So, um, let's see if we can fig find the ones that we need to fix first. Um, I know I saw another one up top. Cycle Constitution plus two. Okay, so let's get those fixed by visiting the pages. Good morning, Biff. I'm not doing too bad. I'm thinking of doing a 32 hour live stream later this week or more likely next week. I don't remember how to do insightful, so let's go down here and take a look. So it's insightful, the full word. Case insensitive. Add your name here to the giveaway. B I F F Goldman. And we've got Andy Josh Hall. Good morning, Andy Josh. Yeah, I did a 32 hour or a 30 hour live stream last week. Um, it's a donation drive to try to raise some money to pay my rent. Um, I got injured at work and have been unable to work, so I needed to do something. Um, planning on doing a 32 hour probably next week based on how everything looks. I actually want to print some stuff up and post it in my 
on my local bulletin boards at shopping centers or whatnot to try to get some more people to pop in and take a look. So that takes care of that one. That takes care of that one. Takes care of that one. That takes care of that one. Okay. Move that over for now. I'm gonna refresh this. We had 95, 93. Okay. Let's head down to the bottom here. Glaciation items, corrosion items, glaciation, corrosion. Combustion, magnetism, combustion, magnetism. Sonic lore, intimidate, resonance, intimidate, resonance, bluff. Combustion. Assassination, Charisma, Accuracy, Double Shot. We have a lot of tabs up there. You can't see all the tabs on the top of the screen, but we have a lot up there. I think that's all of the ones that follow that pattern. So what I want to do is I want to do, I want to figure out a quick template or parser command, basically, that I can copy and paste on all the pages. So, wiki help parser no string functions okay so I want replace
it's not going to work on this one. Let's see if I can find one that it will work on. Let me look at the pattern here. So it's always... I chop items off of the end and then I take whatever the last thing delimited by a space is okay so what I'll do is repaste page name look at this again I want sub start length so start going to be sub page name start position page name underscore minus two Let's find the first underscore. 10. Okay, the first underscore is 10. So I can't do a minus with a... Oh, so I can do an R pause. I can do an offset. Can't do it that way. Okay. That's the first one, but I don't want the first one. This will give me the last one. Thirteen. If I go back... One, two, three, a maximum of five characters. Actually, six characters. Because if it was three digit number with a plus sign and a And a um, percentage sign, that's five characters, plus I want one more for the space. So if I do that, I go like this. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. 
Okay. Now if I take that... I go like this... I want to look for in page name. I want to look for underscore in starting at that. Okay. 10. Okay, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That's what I want. So starting at page name, starting at 10, 77 items. Okay. So that only gives me the end. So I want to start at zero. So 10 characters. Should give me just glaciation. Excellent. Then I can go items. Okay, so I should be able to take this. I should be able to go category, glaciation, items. I'm gonna do Subst Okay, so Good morning wildcard 1978 Let's add you to the drawing here Feel free to join me in discord chat Good morning, El Pair. All right, so that takes care of that. I want to start zero. Nope, I want to do space, pad, something. With zero three spaces. Make sure I got my pad right. Discord is https discord.me slash DDO stream. And https discord me DDO wiki. There you go, some links for you. So there's no bang in front of it. 
There is. Oh. Had left. Add left thing, string length character. Okay. Three pipe zero. Okay. So I need How's it going, shoe? Pretty good. Welcome to the stream. Let me fix that, my sound's all messed up. Sounds okay on my end. Let's see here. Yeah, but it's playing through like the speakers on my monitor. <laughs> ah. Let's see here. If I want to get just the number out of that. We're gonna take Whatever this is. I don't know why it does that. If I flip and put my audio to my headset, if I'm playing a game, it screws up Discord settings for some other reason. Forgot what server you played on, though. I used to be a hardcore uh, Kyber. I play on um, Kenneth, Wayfinder, Galanda. Orion. Yeah, I know you played on a few. I haven't played in a long time. I got like really sick and then I've been fighting for disability and like half my characters are locked out and it's like, uh. <laughs> okay, so start there. I gotta bring this into notepad so I can see where the braces go. Seems like a lot of work just to add something to video wiki. Yeah, it's a little bit of work, but it's still shorter than manually typing out the page name for all 80 pages. I want to go there. What does that give me? need is I'm gonna need length of subst 
That's not going to work either. Go five characters. Okay, that's good. Replace. Plus. Percent. Space I space IT and space. So we got plus with nothing percent. Nothing. wiki space nothing I or IT Plus, this with nothing. Oh, boop, 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 boop. That should take care of it. Not quite. What am I missing? Ah, okay. I... Because it's already replaced the space. There we go. 77. Now I just gotta get the pad working. Which goes on the outside. Perfect. Good morning, Iron Hands. Cropping the number out of that is harder than cropping the page name itself. All right. Copy. Glaciation items, good. Excellent. So now I can start a little thingy here. This.
Repetition. Gives us our ten people to be able to roll at the end of the stream. Went back to text there, wildcard. Oh, I just had my headset off for a second. I was trying to like pump up my frames per second in Wildlands. I do play other games. <laughs> so do I. <clears throat> On my 30-hour live stream last week, I played DDO, Lotro, Stardew Valley, Polybridge, Minesweeper. I think that's it. I've been playing. Uh, I've been playing a lot of uh, Mass Effect Andromeda. And back around. Okay. I've been playing around with Ansel and, and Wildlands and Mass Effect of Drama because they had them contests going on, so. It won Wildlands from NCIX, so. There you and go. Andromeda, I, I traded a mouse I won for it. I'm eventually getting my P whole PC built just by winning some stuff online. <laughs> I've gotten, like, really lucky lately. <laughs> End of last year, you ain't gonna believe this. I won a 27 inch Samsung curve uh, monitor that only does up to 72 hertz and AMD FreeSync. Still a nice monitor, 1080p. Then I won a few games like BF1 Ultimate, Titanfall 2 Deluxe, won 16 gigs of DDR4 RAM from Guile. Uh, I won like Two gaming mice on PAX East weekend streams. And then I won a full Steel Series setup from the same weekend, but I didn't find out till a week or two later. It was $500 with stuff, a $200 keyboard, a $100 Rival 700 mouse with tactile feedback, mouse mods, a t shirt, an Artix 5 headset. <laughs> and then a week after that, uh, uh, Ubisoft sent me an email. I found out I won a 1080 Founders Edition from the 400 sweepstakes. Cool. It doesn't include the other shirts and stuff I won from like AMD Ryzen. Won a swag bag from them. Uh, I recently won a sweatshirt from NCIX. I ain't got that yet. And then I won a uh, Watch Dogs 2 figurine from the uh, Watch Dogs 2 stream. <laughs> I've been on a roll lately.
best way to check how much a, a local change will carry over to other pages is to go to the other pages and um, purge them to see what the update looks like. There are a couple ways to do that. We'll go over that once I get done with this mass edit. I probably could have done with the bot if I really wanted to. But, meh. Man, I'd mess that all up. I don't type that well. <laughs> if I would have done it with the bot, I would have missed all of these ones where it's creating um, subcategories that haven't been made yet. That one got broken. I would have missed stuff like that if I'd done it with a bot. Motion items, good. For some reason, the ones with the plus and the percent are the ones that are getting messed up. Fun of wiki editing.
Looks like a lot of work. Not really. All I'm doing is clicking on a tab, pressing Control V to paste it, typing CA, clicking on Categorize and Save Page. It's repetition. That's it. going to be another double one. I type this one out. Getting there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more pages to do. Then we can go back and make the parent categories for a couple of them. Quite right on that one. That. That was a dull moment.
That's all right. Add you to the list here. So Mystic Diversion items, I don't know where to put that yet. This should be under Mystic Diversion items. Place yet, but that's okay. Sightful distant diversion items. items hey puff granny add you to the list Should be doing that, shouldn't I? <sighs> For now, whatever. Yeah, I need some more coffee as well. Go ahead and pour me a cup. accuracy <clears throat> copy paste all category tab paste copy all category accuracy items let's see what that's listed as there we go that's the one I want that's what Mystic Diversion item should be. Quality Distant Diversion items. Inside items. Initiation items. Dodge items. Corrosion items. We've got corrosion. Motion. Combustion, have devotion, 
combustion, erosion, already have accuracy, combustion, back to that page, okay. Table with favor X quest level should be, be very nice. I'm not sure what you're asking for. I'm planning on getting rid of all of those quests by whatever pages in favor of a single sortable quest by everything. Tumble belly. Add tumble be belly to our list here. Three L's. I'm planning on putting it all together on one page and then possibly having a variation of that page broken up by pack because there are a few people that prefer that look all right so let's see what we go from from 93 after doing all that how many did we just do 22 so that means we did 71 pages there all right So, what was the question? Modify the Legendary Hawks page, will that change carry it over to other pages such as Veil of Twilight? Let's take a look at the Veil of Twilight. Don't believe it currently will come to this page because this page isn't dynamically done. Yeah, this page isn't dynamically built yet. So what we have to do to fix this page for now, simply boop. Just like that. Gone. Eventually I will have this automatically populated. But for now... It is what it is. Good morning. A-I-N-A-R-A. Save. Okay. 
So let's see here. What else can we do here? Well, I guess these can both be anniversary party monsters. Monsters and Anniversary Party. already a category for that these should all be broken up into that I'll have to think about how to do that okay okay so favor X quest level I guess there isn't a single template page except for Favor isn't listed in here. This is all quests in one table. I don't have favor in there yet. Some of the sections, there are outcast quests that aren't populated quite right because of the way that they're done. The weird way that they're done in-game. In like these ones. I need to go through and fix it. There was a change that I haven't been able to fix yet.
I can add favor to that. I can also see if I can fix those raids that are not showing XP values because they're solo only. Alright, let's do this. I got those two 18 by 18 icons. Is there an 18 by 18 with a lowercase i? No. But if I go to the bottom up here, it'll say icons by size. It's supposed to have a lowercase i. Yes, I can add favor to the columns there. Absolutely. Takes care of that. <laughs> that one. Here, tier collectibles. That seems broken to me. What's in there? Collectible tier one. This case one. So it's the same thing. Okay. It.
coming out all of the categorization in the sandbox for now. Isn't it coming out of there? Will a null edit fix it? Yes. Okay. That means it's part of the monster template. Oh, it's because people are using Habitat 1 Reaper difficulty. I don't know how I want to resolve that. Redundant to Reaper race monsters. deal with that. No, let me, while I think about it, let me work on the great axis.
should be marked as no minimum level. It should be automatically marked as no minimum level as well. Unless there's something specifically in the template preventing level from working. Level's not even listed in there. Named item. Ah, okay, cause it, so it's min level is listed here. Have to null edit those for the change to play take place. There's no other level hand axes. Monsters and Reaper difficulty. <sighs> so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add, I'm gonna modify the monster template. I had some other stuff I wanted to work on today as well, but I guess we're not going to have time to get to that. Not a big deal. Uh, 
habitats. Okay, so I still wanted to show the quest, I just don't want it to be in the category. This sub work again. If equals lowercase. Position. what I want, I want zero to that point. Reaper, okay, there we go.
Okay, so what that should do... Hey, PRS-778. What that should do... Is that should take Carnage Reaper here. And take it out of Monsters and Reaper difficulty. Let's do a null edit on it and see if that does, in fact, do that. <clears throat> Doesn't. Let's add you to the drawing. Why doesn't it work? Oh, because it's only got one habitat. Okay, that's why. I need to copy it down here as well. Okay, so I shrink this down, do a null edit on this. Now it should be pulled out. It's not. Why isn't it pulled out? Mm. That's kind of frustrating when it doesn't work the way it's supposed to. If there's a habitat, if there's no habitat, the monsters with no habitat, unknown. Otherwise, check to see if lowercase habitat value starting at zero, going to the first space is Reaper. If it is, skip it. Otherwise, monsters in habitat one. Habitat one. All right, let's copy this, go to Carnage Reaper for a second. is Reaper. Is lowercase Reaper. Why is it putting in category monsters in Habitat 1?
So there's no cat here. So strange that it's categorizing anyway. Maybe habitat value is not what I think it is. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? Good. Live test. Hate doing live tests, but sometimes that's what you gotta do. Okay, so nothing is coming up. That's why it's not working. Probably because I'm outside of the loop. Oh. That's why. Okay. Um, I should be rolling in about four minutes. That's what it needed. Now I can do my null edit and it will be gone from the category.
Excellent. I'll edit those. Hey, Zender, you made it just in time. I'm gonna be doing the drawing in just a minute. Need to add E L G U E R, and we need to add one. I S. Really? Oh, I see the picture, but I don't see the name. It must be behind my thing there. Uh, Bremrick, I believe. Thank you for the follow. Good morning. Party Dragon. Hey, okay, we got 18 people this week. I might bump my um, requirement up to 20 next week. Hello, Brumrick. Nineteen. Anybody else before I do the drawing? We've got about one minute left. I'm going to do it at 9:55 a.m. according to my clock. With the delay, that should be less than a minute. Oh, you're going for the affiliate? I, I already have affiliate. I'm doing a drawing for a 500 DP code giveaway for Dungeons & Dragons Online. Oh, you were talking about, like, to bump up your requirement up to whatever. Yep, I, um... For I my just, giveaway... Like... For my giveaway, I actually uh... have a program that I wrote, and I require a certain number of people to say hi in chat, and I add them to the, the list, everybody that says hi. And this week I had it set for 10 people needed to say hi. I just assumed it was uh, something to do with affiliate or something. Oh. <laughs> the way you said it at first. My bad. Alrighty, here we go. Doing our drawing. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Four, three, two, one. Alrighty. That takes care of the roll. You are entry number 14. Alrighty. Wrap up this right here, and we'll wrap up the stream. Never made it to unused files either. I wanted to go through this page and start tagging things for deletion, which is part of what the other thing it was that I wanted to do. Yeah, I'll do it later. Maybe next week. Um, wanted categories. So we took it down from 97, I think it was, to 11. That's not too bad. So, thank you everybody for showing up for the stream. Um, let's 
stay tuned for GDOPL starting at 3 p.m. Um, followed by the stream stream at 7 p.m. Um, Nux Sapporo should be hosting Minion Monday next week at 4 p.m. Eastern. Um, and I should be back next, possibly next Tuesday, um, the 23rd, for DDO Wiki Talk. Um, if not, because I might have something coming up, I should be back May 30th. Um, I will also be doing Minion Monday on May 29th, where we will do the Shrouds. Um, have a great week, everybody, and I will catch you later.